Hey everyone, it's Ev. It's that time of year where if you live north of this line, you might just get sick. And it's important to learn, of course, how to be sick. This instructional video is dedicated in part to the lady at the grocery store. Now to test each one of these mangoes for firmness. Not this one. Hey lady, put down that mango and stop for a second. This is your elbow. This is your face. Should you cough or sneeze, position the inside of your elbow in front of your face so that it covers the nose and mouth. <laughs> there. Now we have significantly decreased the possibility of you infecting the world. Even better, just stay home. Especially you, Mr. I'm gonna show everyone how I'm such a hard worker. Hey, you don't look so good. Maybe you should go home. No, I've got a ton of work to do. <coughs> I'm starting to feel a little better, but why am I the only one here? Now I know what some of you are thinking. I'd much rather be hitting the slopes today, so why don't I call work and just tell them that I'm sick? If you're gonna call out sick, don't overdo it on the acting. Hello? Oh my, you sound terrible. Why don't you take the day off, since you're so sick? Just wait till you need a reference. Also, don't advertise your call out. Tweet! And don't forget your follow through. Look, I can stand on my head. My, you certainly are feeling better today. Uh, <coughs> yeah, I'm feeling a bit better, thank you. If you are going to call out, just sound normal and use the words explosive and diarrhea somewhere in your explanation. Some people take the fake sick thing to a whole new level. Fake dying. Yes, med seekers, you aren't fooling anyone. So, tell me what's going on. I've got severe pain everywhere. Only one thing can help. It starts with the V. 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 Vicodin. Yeah, that's the one. I can never remember the name. Mm-hmm, sure you can't. Let me just log you in here. Mm -hmm. They also test to see if you are faking unconsciousness by dropping your hand on your face. If your hand falls anywhere else but your face, you're a faker. Though in your defense, they do feel bad if you truly are unconscious and smack yourself. Kind of like how they tested for witches in the old days by tying girls up and throwing them in the river. If they didn't save themselves, they weren't a witch. Hooray, my daughter's not a witch. Oh. Please comment below. Let me know if you've either been real sick or fake sick so far this winter. Don't forget to thumb me, and until next time, peace. Welcome to Behind the Scenes in my closet. Uh, I just wanted to show you how to make a voice sound like it's coming through the telephone or recorded is to actually record it and then re-record it being played through your iPhone. I saw it on Pomplamoose and thought it was pretty cool, so little tip. So over here, you will find a link to a video that I did on Immaturity Crew Productions. But before you click the link, you gotta know that it's a trailer for a series that I plan to do, and I really focused on the production value. I don't want to do stick figures forever. I want to try something a little different, and while the production value might be where I wanted it, it... All right, it's really not funny. <laughs> it's embarrassingly not funny. But I promise that come February, when full episodes are going to come out, because this is only a trailer, I'm going to put my heart and soul into it and make it really good, so check it out.